players are running Miss Magus, like both of them really oh. heavy on that. Well, um, I think he ran and he ran Mega Ray against um, yeah Suicune. I was telling them to, I told them to try out Mega Ray just because I like it against I, uh, I like it against uh, Rasmus, but I had to make an adjustment later on. But well, you did end up pulling around in the end. Yeah, anyway. it was close. It's always close. But. All right, getting in around one here. This is losers round four. Actually, Gale electing to go with Umbreon. I like it. Mainly contest burst. Yeah, mainly contest burst and just punishes air game like completely. Yep. And spot and but the problem is Zeph likes hanging on the ground too. He likes doing both. So it could be a double edged sword for nice, SK Daily. Nice punish on the CA yeah. attempt. Yep. Oh, it's a little too high, but Zeph Zeph not capitalizing. Zeph not capitalizing off with that eight Y. Oh, oh it gets the I, grab. I, I like that mix up by Zeph. But Dale thought he was gonna break his shield. You thought? Like I thought. Yeah. Well, when your shield's red, most of the time people are just going to go for it, either with the belly bump or something yeah. to break the shield. But now Zeph's like, no, I'm going to capitalize on this. Like Zeph is still doing really good on the hooks right now. Just not letting SK deal do much right now. Good old itch, yep. Big. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the worst counter to dig on. It's the worst feeling. It's a grab. Oh, no. All right, Dale's living, and he does have the Umbreon on deck. But nice right. punish by Zeph. Fire punch, yep. That was a really good punish there. It's a nice game. Both players kind of feeling each other out more of this neutral setup or neutral game. Yep. He's trying really hard on these kids right now. Zeph is just he, he knows when it's coming. Nice. Nice overhang from the cart. A lot of damage here. He's trying to... Yeah, we actually saw a little bit of high stance attack. I'm not sure what he was looking for. Maybe he was just trying to hard read a grab, maybe, right. or something. Nice. Gale not having it. Actually looks for that over the Umbreon and then goes for the mid-range Sand Tomb. That was a good mid-range Sand Tomb, too. That's something that I see SK Dale do. I don't really see any other guard shop do it, is elect for the mid-range Sand Tomb just to get some damage on the board. Yeah, yeah. it's not going to be a huge combo, but it does get damage on the board. It's just there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's uh, that's it. it, yep. yep. Good job by SK Dale. Yep. It's another good, clean, solid round the right by poke. both players. That's what he needs to do. He just needs to get the right pokes. Mm -hmm. No huge the, damage combos yet. Both of these characters love poking, and they're just capitalizing off them later out, like instant momentum off the cap, off the poke. Yeah. I'm interested to see, like, Zeph all day has been really holding on to his burst, like being very passive with it. So I want to see, I don't know if he's running a different support for that, or I don't know what his thinking really is of holding on to the burst so frequently. Maybe because he knows that Miss Magius' attack buff doesn't last as long as Eevee's. Nice counter, nice hit on the uh, yeah. normal frame there. Zeph able to get out of there with the Inferno cancel. And as I was saying, um, I think because he knows that Miss Magius' attack buff doesn't last as long, he's trying to just find that right, perfectly right moment to use it. Yeah, we'll see a burst, double burst by these players. All right, all right. Oh, that's a burst confirmed. That is a confirm, yeah. Dale's going to be living, but Zeph is in a good spot. He's going to go straight into field. He's going to be pestering him uh, with the... With the projectiles here at field. He's got a mismagius ready to go. Mm -hmm. He actually is going to pop it. Try to lock him Dale down a little bit. See, I would, uh, no, I'm actually going to take it. I would actually really love to see uh, Dale parry that hit with his burst. And with the red armor. Oh, uh, yeah. It. I'm not sure. You can. I'm not sure if uh, when Charizard backflips back with his homie. If, you can he, if he is out of range of the he's overhead. Not, he's not. Because he'll, as on the fall down, he falls down really quickly. Yeah. So it'll catch him like right on the tail end. Yeah. But that's what I would like to see the, him utilize red armor more. Well, maybe Miss Magius would have gotten it out because it does break counter. And all red armor moves do get broken from counter breaks. Once again, getting some damage on the board in that mid range sand too. Oh, 6Y. Oh, another Seth answering back. Punished. Nice 8Y there by Sir SK Dale. All right, this is going to be some good damage here. He does have some pretty high PSP, but he is going to get some solid damage. Oh, at least right after this. Nope. He knew he was going to drop. <laughs> nice. See how this Zeph with that uh, high stance attack again? I'm, I hope, I want to see it actually work. I want to see him do it. I think it works more against zoners, honestly, or somebody that has like a really a, like a really good command grab, honestly. Right. Like, oh, oh, actually digging underneath it. Dig is, dig is good. Correct. Dig is good, ladies. Dig autocorrect is good. <laughs> Look at that. It's like iframes out here. Well, something happened. All right. At least next shield in that. I don't mind the hard call. But Zeph at the beginning of the field phase. They're just trying for something. Oh. This is gonna be a lot of damage. A lot of damage. He actually tried Phil Swift here. He actually tried for the harder, uh, the harder combo instead of just going for the straight seismic toss. Yeah. 
Castillo. Really, nice really thing. bad position right now. Tagging him with two wide. Zeph getting a lot of mileage just out of his normal CA. And nice. Sand too. Stone Edge. Stone, Stone Edge, yes, excuse me. <laughs> they both start with S's, it's okay. Okay. Nice crossover. That was a good, yeah, that was a good crossover. Nice damage there with the release X at the end. Going with the Sand, Sand Tornado Oki. Yeah, he is. That was a Medius grab. He was really plus. Really, it worked because he was plus. Okay. Alright, Zeph. Pushing the panic button. He wants to try to secure this round still. He wants to. Ah, oh, dig not working out for him. See, I'm not sure if the first hits are a light, and that's why it worked. Oh, baited. Baited. Ah, uh, that, that'll work. No. Nope. No animation. Not too much, yep. Dale really wanted to keep his post down. Now, it's, now, now it's, Dale, it's Dale's game to lose right now. Yeah. There we he go. He did get it. Yep. I was like, it's, he wanted to keep that burst as long as possible just in case he lost. Though Charizard has a, if Charizard wins two or two field phases, he'll be at least be like like eighty percent uh, CC for his burst. So, but Dale just really wanted to hold on to it just in case he needed to. But it was a good idea that he used his burst when he needed it too. Right. All right. No, no support changes. Nothing. We're just going straight back into it. Game three. I think it's good. I think both both players have their supports that they want to run. Uh, Zeph was doing a great job of baiting out Umbreon, but uh, tried to burst punish a little too early. Oh, yeah. Can we just take a second to appreciate how many games we've gotten on stream? Yeah, it's been great. It's amazing. It just shows the power of Nebraska against each other. Yeah, everyone's been... This this tournament more than most, I've seen a lot of players, like a little, uh, maybe some newer players, that have really leveled up today. And, of course, I mean, we always have the, the veterans here that are going to do... A great stuff. And Such high level play. Yeah. Them, yeah. But you can just see like little little changes to yeah. everybody to optimize. Nice damage there by SK Dale. Getting so much damage in that one dual phase. Nice. Able to snag it. Not going to close out the round, but it's sitting really nice. Oh, I don't, really, uh, I don't yeah. necessarily like the call out. It was okay. He has a lot of HP, so he, he could afford that mistake. Oh, okay. Uh, he's not going to afford this mistake, though. This is going to take it. This is going to oh. take him out of the corner, though. He does have a large health pool, so it's okay. Miss Magius being set up. Nice. Um, Calls it a little too late. Zephyril not calling the um, yeah. not calling the uh, Miss Magius long enough, and SK Dale was able to just eight wire grab. You're able to see the knowledge in the lab work that Dale puts in. He knew. He knew exactly what the setup was, and yeah. he knew exactly how to counteract yeah. it. He, he wasn't he, scared. He wasn't scared because he knew like the exact timing you need to throw on this mage. So he knew I can hit by this grab. I can hit. Oh, oh my, what? What the? Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Some... Nice dig. He needs to just go with uh, two X's there. Oh, okay. That uh, backdash having that I, those iframes, those really weird iframes. It was a cross up, unfortunately, because it actually took him out of the corner. Exactly. Nice. Yep. Nice, nice by Seth. It's not going to kill. No. He's working his way here. We're gonna have a, we might have a game three, round three of how this looks. Oh, actually, he'll jump off the select out of it. Don't edge. I like that a lot. He's actually able to off the select out of that. Yeah. SKD in rage, though, but not for much longer, though. Pretty pretty close game. Honestly, any uh, whatever player gets a, gets a combo here, it's probably going to take it. Oh, yeah. And especially if you can get your opponent to use their burst and still win. He doesn't want. Yeah, he doesn't. He wants to. He's trying to bait out that burst on Zephyr right now. Right, we he got, doesn't want to use his. We got 15 seconds left. <sighs> Footsies. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Flamethrower taking it for Zeph. Then we got game three, round three here, ladies and gentlemen. Dale kind of had to just. Since he was the one running in, Dale just had to guess what mm -hmm. Zephyr was going to do. There. Unfortunately, it didn't work out one. Okay. Actually, clashing. Nice sand pocket sand. Out. Yeah, very slow grab. Uh oh, fire punch. Just going to put Zeph in a pretty juicy lead here at the beginning of the round. Uh, not too much, okay. but it's still quite a bit. Drops a combo, but keeps him in the corner still. It does shield that. Digging nice, the way out. I like Dragon Rush cancels in the thing. It's it's so tactical. Your opponent's just going to expect you to run in. Oh, he's not holding it long enough. Zeph, Zeph going to get hit here. Oh, oh, he should have. I think he should have just reset it. Oh no. Nice. Reset. Nope. He's just Cap going for the damage. Yeah, capping out with PSP. He didn't have much left. I think he could have just reset it with his burst, but I mean, I'm not Dale, so. He's sitting on a really nice lead. Yeah. There oh! You go. There we get go. the sand in right on Zephyr right yeah. at the end there. See, I'm not, see I, I want to know Zephyr.